The Brixton riots was in 1981. Um, that was a difficult period because it was a period when we had many, many difficulties with the relationship between people of African heritage and the police. During my, my youthful years in here, I have known the, the police of Brixton, or just down here, going on an exercise which they call nigger hunting. The nigger hunting meant that when we first came here that we were prime targets for abuse. And you were not abused because you did anything wrong. You were abused because you were of a different pigmentation. And that's what it was about. And so, the Brixton riots came about when young people, they, they went through a process called SUS. And it was at the time of the, the Tory government, because Maggie Thatcher had just become prime minister in 1979. And it was the attitude which led to it. There was a kind of arrogance. And pe they didn't care about how people felt, or what people felt, and so on. They didn't take any of this into concern. And so it just took one little incident and the whole place was on fire. And we tried to warn them from the West Indian Standing Conference, but no one took any notice of this. And that is what is happening today as well, because we told them about the incidents with the knives as well back in 1989. So it's almost 20 years ago and today it's out of control. So you know, many times it happen, when things happen, it is normally the fault of the people who are making the decisions. They don't understand, and sometimes we think that they really don't care.